Hey, Paul here, and I'm playing How to Survive. Yeah, it's been a while since I last released a video on this. Uh, this is mostly due to the fact that the game has a really pain in the arse save system, so the last time I played, I had to collect a bunch of packages, and the packages I did collect, the uh, I didn't get to the save point, so I'm going to finish this mission first. And because of that, I basically had to collect all the packages I did in the last video a second time, which is a bit of a pain, but um, not to worry. So, I still have a couple of packages that I need to pick up on that first island. What the hell's that sound? I don't know, it's been a while since I've played this on the- oh my god, this bird's kicking my ass. It's been a while since I've played this, but um, Let's see what we can do, and of course, of course, this is the one over there. I'm assuming there's any... I can get in and I will go all the way, you know, the long way around. Bit of a pain. Uh, I'm about getting close to 50% tiredness. to make that. Hi. Ignite this. It's getting dark. I want to open that and see if I can sleep, but I'd have to fight a bunch of waves. Truth be told, I don't know if I can survive. But let's give it a shot anyway, shall we? So... I have anything I can eat to get my health up a little bit. I've got one cooked meal that'll give me some health back, but it's gonna heal my wounds. But let's eat it anyway. I'm gonna need my health for this bit. So what I've been doing when I've been clearing these is to go in. Try and find the sweet spot. Or at least we close it. So what I have to do is deal with the zombies coming out of this room. Okay, might be a good idea to keep bringing fat ones out. They don't normally, so... Yeah, that's gonna be dangerous. Ah, oh, there's more zombies in there. Okay, the big one. Far enough away it doesn't hurt me too much, but... I gotta be very careful that that's the easiest way for me to go. See, clears the ones outside, which is good. The tricky part is when I can't kill outside, and I have to open the door to take care of them. That's dangerous. There's four of them there. You know. Oh wow. Okay, I was able to uh, do that from here. Package. Come on, let me open the door. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and close this. I need to need a bit of a kip. Hopefully it will uh, skip through nighttime a little bit just so I have to deal with those nighttime creatures. Yes, perfect timing! Look at that. Okay, so let's consult the map. I need to get to... So, the, the red things are barricades that I have to break now. Okay, so there's no way about it. I need to go south. Break one barricade down there. Which I do have the ability to. And I should be able to get the rest without having to break anything else. So that's good. That is good. So we basically just got to survive. Hi. Just gonna survive. Easier said than done. There's a bunch of 
zombie ostriches after you. Okay, we've got a fuel pump here, that's important because in order to get through some of these doors. Second empty jerry can. I suppose I've got the room right now. So we'll go in and fill it. Chances are I'm going to run into a point where I'm just out of uh, empty bottles, but for now. Okay, why am I going this way? I need to go south. I have to visit each island, which is a bit of a pain. In fact, I have to visit each island. Can I get to all of the islands from this, uh, from like the original, or do I have to make my way from here? We'll see. Bloody birds. the uh, developer of this game, or the developers, have added a few few more things to it. I've seen in recent patches, but it's been such a long time now since I last played this, and when the patches were released I don't know what they are, but they were something to do with multiplayer, so I think it was multiplayer story co-op. So this game might be quite fun if you do that at the time. Invent some of the, or make some of these crazy inventions that you can do. Green beef soda, that sounds disgusting. <laughs> okay, so I actually level. Go ahead and do that now. I've got one extra skill point where I'm going to invest that. Oh, I get an extra Molotov. Oh, that could be good. See, that's the only one I want. The uh, pain, uh, pain, uh, pain insensitive. But I'm gonna have to go all along this train, and I'm gonna do it in time. So I'm just gonna go ahead and drop my point here. Get the Molotov stack, uh, stack extension. I could respect though, but screw it. Okay, so speaking of Molotovs, let me just check. Wait, I passed. Okay. Another package. Have to clear each island whenever I can. So we should have a package here. And then what I'll do is maybe take that transport boat and see where it takes me. Because I have to take this package back to the original guy anyway, so I still have a few of them left on that original island, so it's not a problem. I do have a multitude of different weapons, but there's no point. The only thing that accomplishes is wasting ammo. I'm keeping that for when I really do need it. And this can't clear waves as quickly as I'd like, but it is sometimes better than others. There's a monkey down there that I could go do the quest for, but screw it, let's stay on track. Stay on track. I want to get this game finished. <laughs> it's been going for a long time and it's like a bit of a break, so we've got to get this done. An empty bottle, that's good. We want to make 
go way up here. Those deers are probably the worst thing to come up against, apart from the exploding guys in close quarters and that big dude. The big dude's kind of easy, but just those zomb just those zombie deer. They just keep charging you. They keep charging and charging and charging. I guess I have to blow that up, which I don't really want to do, so. I've got that package, there's one more package on this island, but I have a feeling I'm going to have to take that boat in the bottom right. Now the other one on the left where I came in at is telling me to go back, but uh, we'll see. Don't know why I ignited that, I just did. I'm hoping to God. Oh, a real deer. Like a, a living one. So I need to go. Okay. I don't think I've seen the camera go into this view before. Then again, I haven't been to this area, so. On the right track. I get lost real easy. I don't even notice that in any of my videos, but consulting the map at every opportunity is probably the wisest thing for me to do. Oh, close. It was, wasn't it? You know, like, oh, that's from my first island. Oh, okay. Okay. Alright, so this island is cleared. Let's move on. So, we need to go back to the big one eventually, but for now. Wait, which island was I on? I have no clue. It doesn't matter. I've got some packages on this island and and in the section I haven't visited yet, so... Do I go left first, or do I go right? Left is closer. But right's like at a dead end. I gotta go through the waterway for right, so we'll go do... I can probably get to the north point via the left-hand side, but... I am just to be on the safe side, I'm gonna go to the left first, clear it out, and then head to the right. Wait a minute. Oh, that's the mother and the child. I forgot I reunited them. The child wasn't dead. It's so me laughing at her falling you know, into the water. Finger the past. Now the problem's going to be... This is a... I've got a double barricade here. That can't be good, can it? Double barricade. What are they trying to keep in? Right. find it. I have a feeling I'm going to have like a showdown with Kovac eventually. I'm dreading that day because I'm going to get my ass kicked. And then the save isn't going to be any good so I'm going to have to go all the way back to the start. That's like an automatic shotgun. Ain't bad, it ain't bad at all. Not the best weapon. No 
are two ways around it. There's no point using anything else. This is fact. Okay, we're gonna go to that one close to us, and then we're gonna hit the right hand side, and we're gonna get this sucker done. That sounded big. Hopefully, it's nothing too big. Sometimes forget there is melee in this game. You do sometimes forget. Just because the range is so superior in this, you don't want the zombies anywhere near you. Whoa, but maybe for this one? Let's go ahead and get this one. I'm going to use my cheap tactic to complete this, but trust me, because what's going to happen is if I stand out in the open and fight, I'm going to get killed. And when I get killed, I'm going to get sent somewhere far back. I'm not going to do any more of these quests for these monkeys. I need to get out of here. What the hell is that? I'm going to check that out, however. Golden Crab. I picked up a Golden Crab. That's probably a mission for one of these monkeys. Screw it, I'm keeping it. Alright, let's do this. Let's do this. So, another oh, fat one's gone. Graphical glitches. Keep an eye out for those explosions. Hmm. Are they called floaters, are they? I forget. So you have to hit one. The bone around. Swing round. Go outside of the wall. And kill these ones out. That's just the way to do it. Maybe you'll get lucky and be able to do that. Oh no. I'm stuck because so I'm wedged between a wall and a shelf. So. But luckily we uh, made it through. Not a problem. Not a problem. I don't know how many I've killed. There's been a few. I think that was the last one. Okay, so we're going to get it in order. Unless there's a. Apparently I can target someone here. There we go. Did I fall over? I think I did. Of course, the last one alive is this, this geezer. There we go. I'm not really tired, so let's just get a move on before it gets dark. Say save. Oh, I didn't realise you could save at these points. I'm an idiot. I'm a big bloody idiot. Okay, well. Wow. We need to make it around now. I can go through, I can go south, I can go across. I have to go up for the waterways on the right hand side. There's no getting around that. 
and I just gotta hope I survive because like, the only places I've really died on this is in the waterways with those little bubbly things that just you know the, the prawn the zombie piranhas I mean that's what they are I think anyway we make it up to there yeah we got this we got this anyway that's it for now thank you for watching hope you've enjoyed my return to how to survive make sure you join me again Goodbye.